Hey everyone, check this out. Hey, look, I am up at the Ekstan Ha Resort. Hard to pronounce, not hard to enjoy. This resort is about seven miles up north of San Pedro town. You can see it or instantly recognize it by the colorful roofs and the way they painted up the buildings. So you got the purples and the reds and the bright greens and the yellows and just a really cool place. And they have nice pools and a great restaurant here. Steph and I are gonna be coming up here for dinner. They have conch, they have fresh fish, they have lobster, they have just everything. And I tell you what, the menu prices are really, really cheap compared to what you would pay at some of these resorts up here. So they've kept the menu prices low, but it looks fantastic. They got this really cool overwater bar here on the dock. You see some uh, fishermen just dropped off some of the uh some of the guests who are out deep sea fishing and uh, some of the beaches up in this area you see are meticulously cleaned uh great swimming right from the beach and that's not something that's always easy to do here in san pedro uh, most of the beaches well they look like this over here a lot of sargassum some trash washes up and on the vacant lands that nobody cares for uh, this is what they look like But the good thing is, is uh, these resorts come in, they hire workers, they really take care of their beaches, absolutely pristine. And um, this is a, a good example of the things that I look for when I'm investing in Belize real estate. Um, because although I'm not an investor at this resort, I definitely check out the properties around here. So are there any good off beach lots? Are there any beachfront lots? Even second, third, fourth row, fifth row, where if I buy and build up here, one of my clients does, I get to have these services and amenities without having to, uh, to pay for all this. So I can come, eat dinner, enjoy a drink at the bar, have my uh, fishing guy pick me up right here at the dock, and yet I keep my cost of living down because I live, say, a block back from here. So that's what I tell people. Look, although beachfront property is where it's at, if you can afford it, if you have that bank account where you can write that check, absolutely get yourself some beachfront. But if you don't, don't let that stop you from getting island property. You can own property on Ambergris Key for as little as around 30,000 bucks. And if you have a golf cart or a bike, you can be to any of the beaches, north or west side in a matter of minutes. So come on down, enjoy the island life. And uh, if you get the opportunity, stay at places like this. So when you book, don't just think about booking places in town. That's really convenient if it's your first day, but uh, try to get a little bit further south or north or over on the west coast. Stay at places like Sapphire Beach, Tranquility, Portofino's, um, for sure Mata Chica, one of my favorite places. It's not exactly cheap, but it is beautiful. But places like this, very reasonable, great local vibe, and uh, you get to enjoy all this. I'll leave you there, my friends. Hope you see in Belize real soon. Take care. Keep living the dream.